All right, what's up guys? Today we've got a question from our buddy who would like to remain anonymous. And that's totally fine. I don't mind at all answering these questions. I don't have to share your name. Um, it's just nice sometimes to sort of have a more personal touch, but it doesn't matter. I'm gonna answer the question anyway for you guys. So, our friend has said, I'm having trouble having dreams. Um, I can't lucid dream or perform reality checks in dreams because I'm not having enough dreams. I'm not having enough dreams, right? So, how can I increase my dream rate, or how many times I have a dream in over the course of a night? Well, this is a, an interesting one, and I'm going to share something with you that hopefully you already knew, but possibly not, judging by your question. Everybody dreams every night, okay? So, that's not really the issue. The issue with you is your dream recall. Not that you're not having the dreams, the problem is you're not remembering them, right? So, you will need to focus on dream recall. And so I do have a few other videos about this, but I'll just sort of give you some basic tips in this one, so I'm not just sending you to another video sort of thing. Dream recall is all about programming your mind to remember dreams. Self-explanatory, right? But the way you do this is by building up a habit, okay? So it's not it's not just a case of, um, you know, writing your dreams down every now and then. It has to be that you build up the habit in your mind that you do it every morning. It's not just like once a week or whenever you have a, a good one sort of thing. Uh, it's more a case of you must build the habit up every morning that you remember your dreams. So every single time you wake up, even if you can't remember anything, and the chances are you won't be able to remember anything at the start because the nature of your problem, right? You can't remember your dreams. Even if you can't remember anything, still write down in your diary every morning, write the date, write anything, uh, any techniques you tried, any uh, if you tried any lucid dreaming supplements, write down next to the date those, uh, write down any particular uh, big event that's happened during that day, you know, that's going to have an effect on your dreams. If you've just done a skydive, for example, uh, then write down this was the skydive day because that's going to probably have an effect on your dreams. Uh, anything that's different to the normal routine of your life, can be important. So just write a little note, you know, if you started a new job or something, or if you've, uh, I don't know, if you've recently broken up with a, a partner, these, these things can be important when you look back, because you see sort of what affects your mind and your dreams when you look back on them. So, write down that, and then if you can't remember a thing, just write down no dreams recalled. That's all you need to do. And then eventually, after about a week or so, probably even sooner, you will start actually remembering bits. Um, and I find the best way to sort of kickstart your dream memory is to dedicate one night okay, to remembering dreams and writing something down. Okay? And this isn't gonna be fun. Well, it might be fun, but it's not gonna be refreshing, okay? Because you're gonna be interrupting your sleep. And this is why you have to choose a day where you don't have work the next morning at eight o'clock or something. A day where you can lie in and just relax and just you know watch Netflix or something like that. So pick a day like that and then set your alarm to go off every two hours throughout the whole night. Keep your diary by your bed, and I guarantee almost 100% you will write down more than one dream that night. You will almost guaranteed, because what you're doing is you're interrupting your sleep right in the middle of your REM period, which is where you're gonna be dreaming, right? And you will, you'll be right in the middle of the dream, so you'll remember it almost instantly, okay? What normally happens with people is they are, say if you're a heavy sleeper, um, you will have a dream, everyone does, you know, you'll have a dream in your REM period of your sleep. But then because you're such a heavy sleeper, you'll carry on into the next sleep cycle and by that time it's gone, you know, you've forgotten about it. Whereas if you interrupt it right in the middle or just after it's happened, you're much more likely to remember it. So yeah, dedicate one day to kickstarting your dream memory. Every two hours set your alarm to go off, write down anything you can remember, which I guarantee you will be a lot. Okay. And then from that day on, you've got used to the idea of remembering your dreams, right? You've got used to writing in the dream diary. Just carry the habit on. Continue doing that every morning, even if you don't remember anything. Write down no dreams recalled. <clears throat> write down the technique. Or if you didn't use a technique, write down no technique used. Just little notes like that. And they will really help you. So I hope this has helped you. Uh, yeah, if you have any other questions, please send them in. And please subscribe if you're new. Subscribe like right now. It takes about one second and it means you won't miss any videos. So cool. See you in the next video guys.